provision is about tax fairness and equal treatment. If taxpayers in income tax states can deduct their state and local income taxes, so should residents of sales tax states. That's just fair. Isn't it time to make this middle class tax provision permanent and provide some certainty to working families across America? This tax provision helps hardworking taxpayers keep a little more of what they earn, which is even more important to families given their stagnant paychecks over the past years. More than 10 million American taxpayers depend upon this common sense deduction, and the dollars that stay in the local community help grow their economy rather than Washington's economy. And here's the key point. Permanency provides certainty to American families, makes federal budget scorekeeping more honest, and removes the asterisk from this temporary provision so that pro-growth tax reform can advance. It's certainly important to our state since it's been restored, Texas taxpayers have saved more than $10 billion, which buys a lot of school clothes, gas for your car, and helps with rising college costs. To be sure, this provision is not reserved for sales tax states. Any American taxpayer can choose whether to deduct their state and local income taxes or their state and local sales taxes. That's fair, and that's equal treatment. And let's be honest, extending this provision temporarily year after year won't score any differently than making it permanent today. I'm proud to have worked on this issue throughout the years with my colleague, Representative Jim McDermott from Washington. I enjoy strong bipartisan support, and I urge my ways and means colleagues to join me in supporting middle class families by making this provision permanent at the same year to year costs of extending it temporarily. Mr. Chairman, I, I yield back.